What's going on guys, today we're talking about Lumen. Lumen is one of the features Epic Games were very excited to tell us about and to put it simply, the feature allows lighting to bounce infinite times all the way around a scene. It also enables light to pick up the colour off the surface it's bouncing off and reflect it, overall making a scene seem a lot more lifelike. So how can we use Lumen and change the Lumen settings? Well first we need to enable Lumen, so hop into the project settings, under rendering, set the dynamic global illumination mode to Lumen, and set the reflection method to Lumen which is just below. Then scroll down to shadow map method and change this to virtual shadow maps. Epic said nothing about enabling this setting in the documentation, however I was getting build errors without it, so feel free to try with and without this setting. And finally, if you're using a post-process volume in your level, in your post-process, under global illumination and reflections, set your method to Lumen. So that is everything you need to enable Lumen. Now, what about the settings? Well, we have two areas we can adjust the setting, in the post-process volume and in the project settings. The post-process volume is just general quality settings and the project settings are a bit more varied. So I won't go into details of the settings, but here's a screenshot straight from Unreal's documentation of both the post-process settings and the project settings. So have a play around with them. I did find, however, the only setting which improved my scene was changing the reflection capture resolution to 512. Okay, two things before we move on. Lumen cannot be used with static lighting. All your static lighting will be removed when Lumen is enabled. This means lighting must be set to either stationary or movable in the details. Also, at current, foliage and translucent materials are not currently supported at the release time of this video. And that, my friends, is Lumen. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.